Sports coming to you live from New Orleans, Louisiana. Well, we're getting ready to call our third game of the year. It's been an interesting season so far, and we expect another great game here tonight as the Falcons get set to take on the Saints. The teams have taken the field and lined up for the kickoff, and they're ready to get this one started. Number two in to kick this one off. This one is handled by Stecker. Stecker returns this one to the 23-yard line. The Falcons come out on a nickel pack with the carry. Ooh, what a stiff one. McAllister running hard, going right through the arm tackles. Ball on their own 30. The Falcons come out on a nickel pack. Lloyd with the tackle at the 37 yard line. This is tough running here. Let's watch him as he gets through right here and he breaks a tackle and he keeps moving forward. I tell you, this guy's hard to bring down. Breeze with a man in motion. It off, sheds the tackle. Hall takes him down at the 42. McAllister busted through for a few tough yards. Ball on their own 42. The backs are lined up in an eye. Gives the ball off. Brooking is there on the stop at the 46-yard line. Callis rumbles forward for a gain of four. Third and under a yard. Atlanta lines up in a 4-3. Gets rid of it. It's complete. They convert for the first down on that throw. And they ran the perfect play to get those couple of yards. First so they have first and ten here. Yeah, you see me. Let's go, boys. The Falcons come out in a 4-3. Let's turn it up, D. Go one, one, one. Get it on. Aimed it off to the back. Snerney is there for the tackle at the 42-yard line. Dallas takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Second and eight coming up here. Horn moves in motion. Drops back, pressure coming, throwing it away. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Third, Third and down eight. and long Ball coming up here. 42 yard line. Hey, let's go! All on us, y'all. Atlanta comes out in their nickel package. Throw it. And he hits his target. That's three times in this drive they've been able to pick up a first down. Yeah, and the thing is, they'll be doing more than just picking up first downs if this success continues. They're going to be picking up some points. First so they have first and ten here. On the 31-yard line. Set. Here we go, baby. Blue, 25. Looking 
to run it here. Reese with the stop at the 28. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. Tenth play of this drive. No stop, no stop that motor. Everything you got. There we go, baby. Atlanta we comes out in their nickel package. Rosen with the adjustment. He does. Johnny has such a quick release, and the ball is out before anybody knows what's happening. And that makes it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. And this is the 11th play of this drive. They're inside the 20. Here we go, baby. Play football. The Falcons with a four-man front. No pass on first down. Throws to the end zone. Complete to the wide receiver. Touchdown, New Orleans. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and a touchdown. I really like the way these guys came right out after you on offense. They made the right calls, executed properly, and put that one right in the end zone. Berger comes in to kick off. From the three. It's still very early. This is one of those spots where you'd like to be able to respond and put the ball in the end zone. One of the great running backs in the league, John, up against one of the league's top defensive units. What do you think? Well, I will say one thing I think we've learned from the last couple of seasons is that a great defense beats a great offense. This one could still go either way. Only one man back. Hand off to the tailback. Grant is there on the stop on the at the 28. You never know when you're going to find some room and break loose into the secondary. Ball on their own 28. Ball on the 28-yard line. Vic with a man in motion. And a counter play. Number 57 is there for the tackle at the 32-yard line. He finds his way just past the first down marker. First and 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Let's go, defense. Only one man back. White in motion. Defense, get ready. Hand off to the tailback. Grant makes the play at the 37. A tough running game will make your passing attack even more effective. Second and four. Ball on the 37 yard line. Come on. Let's go, man. Orleans comes out in their nickel package. Rosen. Fujita is there on the stop. Excellent recognition by the receiver, reading the coverage and adjusting his route accordingly. Option routes are receiving routes designed to take advantage of the coverage. It's up to both the receiver and the quarterback to make the same read. If the receiver reads zone, but the quarterback reads man, you can see passes going right to defender. New Orleans goes with a four-man front. The rush is on. He'll keep it. Simmons with the step at the 46. Run it down and ran with it, but couldn't find any room. That's excellent discipline by the defense. They stayed in their lanes, and they got to him before he could even get going. Ball on the 46-yard line. Ball on the 46-yard line. The Saints line up in a 
Going to the left. Smith is there for the tackle at the 46-yard line. He didn't hit the hole with much conviction on that one. After one quarter of play, the score is 7-0. Saints. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Third down, and to convert, they have to get it to the 39 on this play. Done. The long back. Payton, the man in motion. Gets the toss to the right. Fujita makes the tackle at the 34-yard line. They brought some extra people but couldn't stop him before he got the first. And run blitzing these guys isn't a bad idea because you know they like to run. But you got to be sure to bring guys in the right place. First, if you think they might run to the outside, additional blitzers in the middle isn't going to help you much. The Saints line up at a 4-3. Grant stops him at the 29. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Ninth play of this drive. Ball on the 29-yard line. Done in the backfield. There he goes. Thomas is there on the stop at the 24. Here's what happened. You get a guy who can move around back there. The defense gets busy covering everyone, and they forget about the quarterback. He gets past that marker and picks up a first down. discipline and execute properly out there. If they don't, they'll find it's much harder to overcome the other team and get a win. First down and a long way to go following that penalty. Vic scans the defense from the gun. Under pressure. Pass falls incomplete. He decided to try and pass it, but he was taking so much heat that it just kind of wobbled out of there. Eleventh play of this drive. Ball on the 35-yard line. Go make the play. A lot of speed on the field for the defense as they line up in the court. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. This one falls incomplete. Kraft teed off on him and it forced the ball out before he could make the reception. Yeah, and he's either going to get in there and knock the ball out, or he's going to knock someone else out. And this is the 12th play of this drive. So an update now on the injury. It doesn't appear to be anything serious, and his return is probable. Throws it. He hits his receiver, and he just got the level. The pass is complete, but not enough for the first. Well short, in fact. Out, hoping to put points on the scoreboard for the first time. The and that kick is him. just it's inside good. the upright. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get it into the end zone every time. Down in a 4 3. Watch your eyes. 
pressure with the throw. Almost picked off. Sometimes in zone coverage, a quarterback will throw to a spot where his receiver is supposed to be. That time, the only one there was a defender who couldn't make the catch. Atlanta using three linebackers. Tucks it away. This one will be spotted at 27. So that tackle was his third. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the open. Ball on the 27 yard line. Defense lines up in the nickel. Drops back with the pass. Incomplete. It was almost like the defenders were in the huddle on that series. They hit a roadblock with everything they tried. Berger will come in now to punt it away. Russell looks like he's ready for the return. From the 29-yard line. Russell doesn't have a whole lot of room to work with getting it to the 39. Goes with a four-man front. And he's brought down in the backfield by Anthony Simmons. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Ball on their own 36. Ball on the 36-yard line. Be careful. The Saints line up in a 4-3. Simmons is there for the tackle. If they keep getting games like this, it could really open up things for them in the second half. Gain a five on the play. Two-minute warning coming up. Vic back in the shotgun. With the throw. And the catch is made. Pushes off. Smith is there on the stop at the 28. Michael Vick is maybe the most fun guy to watch in football. I mean, any time he gets his hands on the ball, and as a quarterback, that's just about every play, you know that something exciting could be right around the corner. Almost at the two-minute mark now. We've reached the two-minute mark Ball here in the first half. The Saints Please come out of the 4-3. Throwing. Ooh, nearly picked off. He was in the right place at the right time, and that saved them from giving up a lot of yardage. Second and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. Let's go, beat this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Done. The lone back. Beverly yeah. comes yeah. in motion. Hey, 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 watch the ball. Watch out. Danny, hey, Danny, Danny. Gives the ball off. Number 57 comes up to make the play. At the 28. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. Closing in. Pumps once. Can't get it away. The Orleans calls a timeout. They have two timeouts remaining. When you play man-to-man -man that well, it limits a quarterback's option. And it'll result in a sack sometime.
comes into the game for the punt. Stallworth back to return. And he chooses not to return this one. Ball on their own 20. The Falcons come out in a dime package. Pass play here on first down. Incomplete pass. The defense was coming after him on that play. He knew he didn't have much time, and he decided to get rid of the ball quickly on that one. Second and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Breeze back in the shotgun. Gets rid of it. Jumps up. He has it. Malloy comes up to make the play at the 43-yard line. Drew Breeze is one of those guys who plays with a little chip on his shoulder. First and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. Breeze starts out of the shotgun. Pressure coming with the throw. This pass is incomplete. Stall was the one they were trying to get the ball to. The defense can't afford to take too many gambles. They're going for a pick when they should just try and knock it down. One mistake can lead to a big play for the offense. The Falcons come out in a nickel pass. Hold the Launches it deep to the left. Drops the interception. Good effort to deflect that pass, which had the big yardage written all over it. Third and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. From the gun. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. D'Angelo Hall has it. The 30, the 20, the 10. Dives, touchdown. He takes that one all the way. comes in to attempt the point after. The point after is good. Most quarterbacks in this league have short memories when it comes to interception. They have the confidence to keep throwing the ball. And many times, they come back and make an outstanding play. made a great play the last time on the field intercepting a pass and taking it back for a touchdown the ball on their own 26 the drive at the 26 yard line first and 10 hey two quarters two quarters all on that y'all going to the air on first down throws it Almost intercepted. He deflected it just in time to avert the completion. The Falcons come out in a nickel pack. Throwing. Right on target to the wide receiver. He recognizes the blitz and gets the ball out for a first down. Yeah, he saw a good matchup. He made a heck of a throw 
to get the ball to his receiver. First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Keep moving. We like to crack the rules. The Falcons come out with a nickel pack. Here we go, baby. Pass play here on first down. Gets rid of it. Wide receiver has it. And he's pushed out of bounds at the 42-yard line. Breeze will be looking at second down now after that pass picks up five yards. It's second down and five to go. Throws it. Ball is there for the tackle at the 33-yard line. We'll probably see them in a hurry-up mode, even though they're in field goal range. First and ten. The Falcons with a four-man front. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Throwing. He hits his receiver. They throw it and pick up a second consecutive first down. Well, when you start to establish something, you want to keep it going until the defense finds a way to stop you. Dropping back to pass on first down. Fires this one deep. It's going the other way. Well played by the defenders. They were looking for the big play on the outside. Here's a spot we're trying to add to the lead before the half can backfire. All it takes is one mistake, and it could be the defense that's scoring. That's why the quarterback has to throw it hard to the sideline so that no one can jump the pass and pick it off. They'll go from the shotgun. Defense, get ready. Pick it up, baby. Pass play here on first down with the pass. He finds his man. Vic completes that one, and it goes for about four yards. Ball on their own 24. Ball on the 24-yard line. Let's go now. Orleans using three linebackers. So after the first two quarters of play, the score is 10-7. Falcons. He's just about ready to kick this one away. From the five-yard line. Russell has a nice return, taking it back to the 41. here on first down with the throw he had a shot but couldn't come up with it and there's not one wide receiver who can ever claim that he's never dropped a pass it's just part of the game second and ten ball on the 41 yard line the Saints line up at a 4-3 running free the 40 the 30, the 20, the 10. He gets all the way in for the touchdown. He gets a great block right here to spring him for the touchdown. I'll tell you, he takes a defender right out of his shoes that time. The point after is good. 
Hey, as an offensive coach in this league, you're always making adjustments. And hopefully you can get the defense on its heels and get it in there for the touchdown. Good job by these guys. Number two, he's back and ready to put this one in the air. Should be a return here. This one is fielded by Stecker. Keeps his feet moving. He has some room. He dives. Touchdown. And what you're going to see here is a good example of how you can set up blocking on kick return. Watch how they create a crease for him. He sees his lane, makes some moves, and he's gone. He's good. Special teams plays are sometimes overlooked, but not there. A kick return for a touchdown. Yeah, special teams play can swing momentum in a heartbeat. A kickoff return, a blocked field goal, all that stuff can sure change the entire tone of a game with just one play. Berger comes in to kick off. He's lined up with a kickoff. Russell back to return. from the three-yard line. Atlanta takes over on offense looking to extend their lead. First and 10. will start the drive at the 23-yard line. First and 10. The Saints come out in a 4-3. Crosses it out to the right. Bellamy makes the stop at the 24-yard line. I'll tell you, if you want to run outside the tackles, you have to seal off the inside and kick out the outside to have some kind of hole to run through. That just didn't happen on that play. Ball on their own 24. New Orleans lines up in a 4-3. Hands it off to the back. Smith comes up to make the play at the 31 yard line. You gotta keep going to the run. You never know when there's gonna be great blocking ahead of you, allowing for a big one right into the end zone. Third and two. Ball on the 31 yard line. They'll go from the I formation. Crossing it left, trying to convert to the first. Drop in the backfield for a short pass. So we should see the punter after they fail to convert on third down. Number nine is ready to pump this one away. Stalwart is the deep return man. From the 20. So they have first and ten here. The Falcons line up in a 4-3. He gets the carry. Lloyd comes up to make the play at the 30-yard line. McAllister picks up some tough yards there. It's second down and five to go. Atlanta looks like they're playing the pass as they're lined up in the dime. The pass falls incomplete. He was pressured as the defense forced the issue. Yeah, and that's something the defensive coordinator mentioned in practice this week. 
making the quarterback throw the ball before he's ready to throw it. Third and five. Ball on the 30-yard line. Only one man back. They're coming with the blitz. Throws it. Oh, he makes the catch anyway. John has proven he's a consistent target. Yeah, especially in situations where they're looking to get first down yardage. First and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. Hey, let's go. Let's run, man. Three, Atlanta five, comes yeah. out in a 4-3. Looking upfield. They'll go with a play fake. Deep throw. And he dropped it. That was a pretty good throw. And the receiver was able to get to it. He just couldn't close the deal and bring it in for the catch. The Falcons with a four-man front. Horn goes in motion. Hand it off to the back. Hartwell brings him down at the 48. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Ball right around midfield. Ball on the 48 yard line. You can't stop me. Tucks it away. Great fake. Launches it across the middle. He made the catch. A few years ago, I watched Drew Brees, and I thought he was pretty good. He was a pretty good player. Then he had a bad year, and he didn't really start off good. Then something clicked. Some light went on somewhere, and he's become a guy who's going to make some plays for you. He got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. Here they come, under pressure, with the throw, nearly intercepted. Stall was the intended receiver on that play. The boxer had the coverage on the play. Eighth play of this drive. So they're now inside the 20 and down by three. Lloyd is there for the tackle at the 12-yard line. Gallup runs it through the middle again of about six. Twelve yards needed to get into the end zone. The offense has been stepping it up on third down all day. Rowan Williams is there on the stop at the seven-yard line. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. Watch the play. Here we go. Everything you've got. Be careful. Hold the look. Here we go. Four comes in motion. Watch me. Yeah, here we go. Hand it off. Malloy brings him down. On the first and goal, they can't get into the end zone. They're just three yards away from the end zone. Drops back. Lobs one into the end zone. Almost picked off. Brooking had his hands on it. I think he was invisible out there. Wasn't even seen. And that's a break for the offense. It's third and goal at the three-yard line. What screen? Keep moving. Get it up. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. They tried to get it out of the ground, and the defense says, uh-uh, not this time.
have a tie game if he can make this kick. The field goal kick sails through the upright. John Carney makes good on the short field goal attempt after the offense drives it into the red zone. They had everything clicking at first and kind of sputtered out, but they still get points. Berger will be kicking off. Sends it sailing. From the four-yard line. Their last drive ended with a three and out as the offense comes out onto the field again. At all on their own 34. At the 34-yard line. First and 10. This time, this time. Set. Go. 36. Set going. Hey, let's go. He gets the carry. Fakes the handoff. Gets the pass off. And just can't find a way to bring that one in. Yet another drop for him. Second and ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. How we go, baby? Rock and roll! Yeah, you see. New oh, Orleans comes out pass. in their nickel oh. package. Here we come. Hey, help! Hey, hey. Oh. They're blitzing. Pressure with the throw. Thomas comes up to make the play at the 45. Good job picking up the blitz and picking up a first down. Yeah, that was a heck of a call. I mean, they saw the pressure was coming, and he knew right where to go with the ball. And then he got it there. First ball on their own 45. Ball on the 45 yard line. The Saints with a four man front. Hey, watch the screen. Then we're going to take it. Yeah. Hand it off. Spotted at the 45-yard line. It's his third tackle in the contest. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Great game so far. The three quarters, it's all tied up. Orleans, 17. Atlanta, 17. The Falcons have possession here at the start of the fourth quarter in this game, which is tied. So it's ten. second and ten. Ball on the 45 yard line. Watch the snap. The Saints line up in a 4 3. Play football. Go make a play. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. He gets the count. Fujita comes up to make the play at the 47 yard line. Done. Battles his way forward for what appears to be a two yard pick. Ball at about midfield. Out of the eye formation. Closing in with the pass. He hits his receiver. They get first down yardage on that play. Is a first down. First and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. New Orleans using three linebackers. He'll pass on first down. Throwing. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. Pretty good play call on that one. Everything happened just as it's drawn up. Just couldn't hang on to it. New Orleans lines up in a 4-3. Thomas is there for the tackle. Dunn takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Third down in the spot they'll have to reach for a first is the 33. They've done very well on third down to this point. Steps up with the pass. Ooh, nearly picked this. Was his intended target. With the coverage. Number nine. 
will do his best to get this one inside their five. Fair catch called for. They have a reputation for pulling out wins right at the end of games. They have another chance to do that kind of thing right here with this drive. First and ten. The Falcons come out in a nickel package. With the carry, setting up play action, throwing, drops the interception. Good timing, getting in between the ball and the receiver to save what would have been a big game. Line up in a 4-3. Running with a lot of room in front. Malloy records the tackle. This is a great block. Watch here. He just barrels into the defender, taking him right off the turf. Now that is a textbook block right there. him down at the 49. McAllister has gained enough for another first down, his second of the drive. Charles Grant. He's back in there after getting taken out with an injury earlier. The Falcons come out in a 4-3. Coleman makes the play at the 46-yard line. McAllister rumbles forward for a gain of four. Second and seven. Ball on the 46-yard line. Let's go, boys! I can do it, man! The Falcons with a four-man front. Crocker is there for the tackles. Good gain on the ground gives them what they needed for a first. That's just good running. They sent a couple of blitzes in to try and stop him in the backfield, but he just broke free and got past the sticks for a first down. First, first and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Hey, let's go! Hey, let's go! Atlanta comes out in a 4-3. Paul comes up to make the play at the 38-yard line. The defense made that play stretch further than the runner wanted to make it. Two-minute warning coming up. The Falcons with a four-man front. Pressure coming. Dragged down from behind. <laughs> when you think about guys who have a big heart, this guy has to be at the top of the list. He just never lets up out there. Ball on the 41-yard line. Eighth play at this run. Almost at the two-minute mark now. Ball on the 41-yard line, and this is the eighth play of this drive. And we've reached the two-minute mark. The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. With the pass, this one falls incomplete. And Malloy comes up to knock that ball out of the receiver's hands before he was able to get control of it. Yeah, we see a lot of footballs popping up when he makes contact. And his instincts know when to deliver the hit and how to do it. Berger is trying to pin them close to their goal line. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. This is just how the coach likes to play it. Keep it close until the end, then put something together with your last drive to come away with the win. Now it's up to the offense to close this one out. First, First and 10. ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Blue there, blue there. From the gun. Direct snap to the back. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. Defensive tackle stops him at the line of scrimmage. Second 
It's second down and a long way to go. Williams using three linebackers. Gets rid of it. Low throw, but he has it. Pratt pulls him down at the 28-yard line. And it looks like they're going to go no huddle. Go with the pass play on third and short with the throw. Bellamy makes the tackle at the 49-yard line. They'll go with a hurry-up offense. Stepping up, gets the pass off. Incomplete as the defender picks it away. He appeared to feel the pressure there. So many passing attacks in the NFL rely on timing. When you can put pressure on the passer, you never give him a chance to get into a rhythm. And you force him to throw Second the ball attempt. before he wants to. Ball on the 49-yard line. The Saints line up in a 4-3. Trying to avoid the hit by sliding feet first. He's trying to get them back to the line. Atlanta calls a timeout. They have two timeouts left. There's about one minute left. Orleans comes out with seven in the secondary. Uses the pump. Rowing. Behind, but he has it. They'll spot this one at the 38. And that tackle gives him three in the game. Plenty of time still left for them to get into field goal range. Under pressure, steps up, gets the pass off. This one falls incomplete. John, he rushed that throw. And you should credit the defensive line. They do a nice job tying up the blockers and can bring pressure up the middle. When you combine their play with the fact that the defensive coordinator likes to bring additional blitzes from the outside, it can make for a very long day for the quarterback. Watch your eyes. Come on. Gets rid of it. Hits his target. Pratt is there on the stop. White hits the reception. A seven-yard gain. It'll be third down now upcoming. So it's third down as they try to get it to at least the 28 and convert. Here we go, baby. So we gonna take it. Looking upfield. Number 57 is there for the tackle at the 25. Nobody on this defense can make a play when they need it. Well, they keep getting them in these third down situations, which is what you want. But nobody on this drive has been able to stop them when it gets to third down. Ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Let's go! Roger! Set. Here we go. Defense, they're ready. Hand it off. Ah. The defender brings him down at the 21-yard line. The tackle is his fifth of the game. There's still some time left on the clock, so I'd run the clock down some more and then try for the field goal. Second, Second and six, six coming up here. Ball on the 21 yard line. Watch him! Danny, Danny, Danny! Watch him go! What now? Hand it off to the back. Grant with the tackle Young at the, the 16. Five Done with a nice burst through the, the middle of time. Five yard pickup. Time kick here. This will put them in front. Atlanta calls the timeout. They'll have only a few ticks left on the clock. We go to overtime. The that gives them the lead here in the final period. 
That's the end the of the final game. score is the final Atlanta score is 20, the New Orleans 17. 20, the Saints 17. This game is presented by the authority of the National Football League and EA Sports. Any publication, rebroadcast, or other use of the descriptions and accounts of this game without the expressed written permission of EA Sports is prohibited. This is Al Michaels. Good night.